Hello everyone, my name is Ekaterina Kardakova, I'm an opera singer, voice and public speaking coach. In this video I want to talk to you about manipulations while communication. I communicate with lots of people every day and with hundreds of people every month, so I noticed that so many people use manipulation to achieve their goals and this is of course the main goal of a manipulator to achieve to have benefits from other people with tools of manipulation so i would like to highlight four manipulation tools in this video you to pay attention when you are being manipulated by other people however this is also the question is everyone can be manipulated by the aggressor manipulator or not because some people react on manipulations and some people not who are the people who is easy to be manipulated. They are usually people like victims, like perfectionists, and of course, people with pretty low self-esteem. And as we all know, many people have the issue of confidence, of being confident to gain more confidence. So if uh, they don't have enough confidence and self-esteem, of course, it's very easy to manipulate these kind of people. So again, pay attention and uh, be aware when you manipulate other people and when other people manipulate you. So number one, the tool number one, the manipulator, the aggressive manipulator, manipulator always doesn't like what you do. For example, between women, we pretty often hear like, oh honey, this hair doesn't suit you, this makeup makes you older, and this dress is, you know, it's so ugly. This is a manipulation. Or some family members say to you, you come to your family members and say, you know, I have an idea, for example, to start a business, or I have an idea to do something, I would like to try out a new hobby. And the family member says, oh, no, 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 you cannot do this. Just don't do that. You will never be successful. This is also a manipulation. Also an example, um, I recently had a conversation. I sent my offer for my training, for my presentation training to a company. And the guy called me back and said, oh, you know, I really like what you do and how you do it. I'm happy with what you send us. But, you know, here how you you wrote this down is not correct enough and you also forgot to do this and you also for, forgot to sign okay i said like okay i can correct it so i sent him i sent him a correct version and he said he called me back and said oh you know but the your uh, the place where you signed is on another side and then you should pay you know put it anywhere, whatever and then after a couple of minutes i said can you please explain me why you tell me how should I make my offers and how should I should I write my offers? And at the end of the day, we said that we cannot work together because I simply put very clear uh, boundaries and said that I'm not a person whom he can manu manipulate. So this is also everything. If, you know, there are some people, he's not good enough and there is not good enough. Now you know, this is a tool of manipulation. Number two is ignore. Unfortunately, here in Germany, uh, people are so used to ignore each other that I also had a conversa conversation recently with another lady whom I sent my offer and I was waiting for the answer for months, really like about four months. I finally could cut her on the phone and said like, I'm waiting for your answer for four months. And she said, oh, you know, not answering is also answering. And I said, no, not answering is an abuse because this is a manipulation. Ignoring is a psychological abuse. And here we also have to divide what is an abuse, manipulation, and what is a pause. And a manipulator will won't say anything. The manipulator will just disappear or won't answer your emails, your texts, or whatever for, for a long time. A person who is not, uh, who is not wanting to manip manipulate you will shortly give you an answer. For example, I'm very sorry, but I don't have the time to answer your 
email right now or your telephone or I cannot back or I call you back later on when I have the time. Anyway, you will always get the short answer. The ignoring is also a tool of manipulation. Next one is putting, um, saying that everything what you do doesn't mean so anything. So it's kind of, you know, not giving you the value you deserve. And, you know, we also say that, or there is a saying, I don't know what by, by word, but it's kind of, you know, the meaning is that your real friends are these, their one who can uh, support you when you have success. And the thing is that also many people are so um, unhappy with themselves, let's say it this way, so unhappy with themselves, so they don't allow you to be happy by uh, saying that everything what you do, everything what you created, it doesn't mean anything. It doesn't have, ha it doesn't have any value. It doesn't cost anything, whatever they say. So know that most people don't want you to succeed because they feel bad about it. And your job is, of course, to don't communicate with these people and uh, just go away, run away from them. And the tool number four is when people shame you for, for example, having your own opinion. Here in Germany, I live in Germany, it happens more and more that people cannot communicate anymore. And when you don't agree with the mainstream propaganda and you have your own opinion about some things, people start shaming you. How is it possible that shame on you, you, are, you don't agree with the propaganda, shame on you, you are an outsider, and so on and so on. So this shaming is also a tool of manipulation, of manipulation so other people feel better about him or herself that's why they put you down. What you can do to prevent this manipulation, just, you know, be confident and know what you want and really claim your well-being. Because when you are confident and you know what you want, you feel happy. Just don't react on other people who don't wish you success and try to manipulate you because they want to feel better. So... If you have something to say for this topic or to this topic, to add something, please do it in the comments below. It's interesting to know what is your opinion about this topic of manipulation while communication. Otherwise, thanks a lot for your thumbs up. You can share this video, subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.